So what is a swale? Number one permaculture question, number one permaculture technique that a lot of people cite, it is the swale. And what it is essentially is a tree planting system. There's trees here, trees here, tree here, tree here. The trees are gonna hold it together because what it is, it's an earthwork. It's when the ground is dug out from here and bermed up down here so that water as it comes down can be pacified. So on flat surfaces, and this is flat, like, you know, l l like in an airport, this is just flat, so that water slows down and becomes still, and when it becomes slowed down and still, it can soak into the ground, and then it can be incorporated, held in place by all these plants. I'm gonna be putting wood chips down in this path soon. I just wanted to make it a little bit, uh, a little bit wider in a couple different spaces, but I wanted to show you the idea because what this is essentially is flat, so it's on contour. Remember topographic maps? When they have those lines, those squiggly lines that make the mountains and they're just like pancakes of different sizes on top of each other, that flat line is a swale. If you dig it out in this ditch-like manner with a soft berm on the bottom that's planted with plants, especially trees. There's some caveats to this though. Some soils, you know, they don't drain very well and so you could have a lot of water. Some places you're gonna need to have spillways. We have a lot of rain here in Seattle, so we have spillways. And then, you know, some places are gonna have winter rains. And so when you have too much water in the winter and you have, you know, springs that pop up eroding your, your fields and your pastures, you wanna have just the amount of water that you need. Not too much, not too little. And then you wanna store in the landscape all the excess. And then pass it on in a clean format, you know, and that's your plants, that's your soil. We can do this, and a swale is an elegant way to start.